When a person plans to buy a car, he first of all thinks about its reliability. This will allow you to operate the machine without problems in the coming years, without fear of breakdown of the main components due to the presence of initially weak points in them. Reliability is a collective concept that includes many meanings and criteria. The ranking of the most reliable cars includes only the best models from different manufacturers that deserve this title and provide car owners with what they expect from their cars. Once upon a time, ubiquitous marketers did not dictate the rules to talented engineers. That is why numerous masterpieces of the automotive industry were born. In those days, when you bought a relatively expensive new car, you really understood what you were paying for, and there was a feeling that this car could stay with you for life, and not be thrown into the trash. After several years of operation, these are the cars we will talk about today. Toyota Of course, this video cannot do without a brand like Toyota. These cars, at least in the past, were super reliable. From everyone's favorite models available now, we'll highlight the Land Cruiser 80 SUV. Toyota, while developing the 80th promising new Jeep, tried to create an armored train on wheels that would feel equally comfortable in the snow, the desert, with any quality of road surface, regardless of the climate and other nuances. In terms of rust, the owners of the Toyota Land Cruiser 80 are very lucky, since the manufacturer chose very high quality materials. The machines are not afraid of the reagents used to combat ice. However, there are places where there is rust, but it appeared once and does not grow like mold. For example, you can often find it on the air intake in the frame area and on the metal frames of the rear windows. This car also has a cool, brutal and, of course, super reliable 4.2-liter 6-cylinder 1HC diesel engine. Its secret is in the simplicity and quality of assembly, one camshaft, two valves per cylinder and, of course, a cast iron block. Recoil is only 132 forces. But without major repairs, it easily runs 500 to 600,000 kilometers. Add here the excellent safety margin of other units and the all-wheel drive system, you get an excellent option for lovers of off-road forays. Toyota engineers also did a good job of building luxurious and, most importantly, fast sedans. Therefore, we could not miss such legendary and trouble-free cars as the Toyota Mark II, Chaser and Cresta, with the outstanding 1JZ engine. Toyota Mark II is a legendary car beloved by the entire global automotive community. The model dates back more than 30 years of production and an entire era that created the cult of the Japanese car. One of the fundamental cars of JDM culture, making fans of the Japanese automobile industry turn their heads with every appearance. There are fewer and fewer stamps, but the demand for them is still high. As a result, their value does not fall after decades, but rather, on the contrary, increases. The beauty of these models, which were produced for the domestic Japanese market, is also in the equipment. If in the 80s it was an electric seat, CD players, spectacular retractable air conditioning units, then in the 90s there was also a seat with memory and a multimedia system with navigation. And the legendary engine made these cars very fast for those times, with an output of 280 horsepower, the six-cylinder 24-valve 2.5-liter engine with two turbines is very reliable and suitable for tuning. With proper maintenance, engines can last more than 500,000 kilometers, and sometimes even more than 600,000. Mercedes Mercedes built no less reliable cars until the late 90s. Back then it was a completely different Mercedes. From the point of view of strength, the phrase reliable Mercedes brings to mind the W123, W201, W126, and W124 body. Mercedes W123 is a car from the past that can still be found on the roads to this day. This model is the predecessor of the modern E-Class. Its production began in 1975 and was completed in 1986. During this period, the Mercedes-Benz concern produced more than 2,700,000 copies, and all of them were successfully sold. Such impressive performance made the W123 the most successful model in the history of the Stuttgart company. The ancient naturally aspirated diesel engines of 2.3 and 2.5 liters are simply record holders in terms of mileage. Every now and then information pops up on the internet about new stories of overcoming the million kilometer milestone with a diesel Mercedes. Time has not spared the good old Mercedes, only the body. 
but what did you want from 30 to 40 year old cars? By the way, gasoline engines also turned out to be quite good. For example, inline six cylinder 3.2 liter engines with a power of 220 horsepower have a super reliable cast iron block, 24 valves, are equipped with a variable valve timing system and, with normal maintenance, also run 500 to 600, or even more than 1000 kilometers. At the same time, the car is fast by modern standards. The maximum speed is about 235 kilometers per hour and passing the quarter in 15.3 seconds. And this is automatic. Today, a good proof of the longevity of these models is their presence on the roads. BMW. Do you think BMW was as unreliable in the 80s and 90s as it is today? We assure you that this is a misconception. These words will be confirmed by the owners of 534 bodies. It has become a worthy successor to the previous 5 Series BMW E28. BMW E34 cars have become synonymous with prestige, a true symbol of the late 80s. The cars turned out to be much more streamlined in appearance than the BMW E28, but still not as rounded as the cars of their closest competitors. The aggressive lines and shape of the radiator grille continue the design tradition established by BMW with the creation of the BMW E33. Despite the fact that the cars look significantly larger and have a more rigid body than the BMW E28, the new BMW E34 was only 10% heavier. The model, which went on sale in 1987, has an aerodynamic drag coefficient of 0.30, which, by the way, is a reasonable indicator for many modern foreign cars. The multi-link suspension provided comfort on our roads, airbags, and good, even by modern standards, equipment. A powerful motor, as well as excellent reliability, yes, reliability. Of course, if it's not a rolled-up copy with a compressed mileage of under a million. The best, in terms of quality balance, in the 34 body is the 525 model with the M50 engine. People called it a slab for its characteristic solid, monumental appearance. This trouble-free motor is only afraid of cylinder head overheating. It has at its disposal a very durable cast iron block, a 24-valve head, and a chain drive with a service life of 300, or even more than 1,000 kilometers. Electronic injection and ignition. Previously, its version did not have a variable valve timing system at all. In this case, this is simply an ideal option for those who like not to look under the hood for months. In practice, such engines of the M50 series run over 500,000 kilometers, and the mileage of some exceeds 600,000 without major repairs. And this despite the fact that the thrust of the 192 horsepower unit is explosive. Audi. Audis were also extremely reliable back then. A very reliable car that is still present on our roads. Over the entire period of its existence, more than 4.5 million models have been sold. This car is the Audi 100. The buyer could purchase the car with Quattro permanent all-wheel drive, but it was also available with an automatic transmission. It is worth recognizing that externally the car no longer fits into the concepts of modern design and is outdated. However, the design of the car is very elegant and was very good for its time. Despite the time, the body of this car is designed with excellent aerodynamic characteristics. A drag coefficient of 0.3 says a lot. The newest Vesta is just a brick in comparison with a coefficient of 0.38. This Audi has a place in the second row, like in a Mercedes S-Class, in a very large trunk 570 liters. And the Quattro all-wheel drive in those years was more honest than the modern one. The owner could manually, if necessary, by pressing a button, lock the center and cross-axle rear differential, after which such a weave turned into a real SUV. And the most important thing is that this whole system is simply trouble-free. The galvanized body on samples starting from the year 85 is almost not subject to corrosion. That is why it is not difficult to find a non-rotten specimen even now. There are a lot of engines for this car, and it's easy to get confused among them. Audi has provided its customers with petrol, diesel, and turbocharged engines. It is impossible to unequivocally answer the question of which engine is better, since time will leave its mark. No matter how reliable the engine is, according to many owners, one of the most reliable engines is the 1.8-liter gasoline engine, 
which has 88 horsepower and is capable of accelerating your car to the first 115 seconds and reaching a top speed of 165 km per hour. When using new modern cars, many car enthusiasts remember those strong and reliable cars that were produced in the 80s and 90s of the last century. The reliability of used cars of the past is beyond doubt. Onwards, from 1982 to 1997, can rightfully be considered the era of the best and most reliable cars in the world.